Yo, are you a true movie fan? Because only true movie fans will understand this video. I'm gonna be taking a movie quiz and seeing if I get some right. But it's really hard movie questions that only nerds like me would get. So let's see if you know any. Which of these films was a direct sequel of Marvel's The Avengers? Age of Ultron, Infinity War, Endgame? None of them. It was Age of Ultron, and I don't even like Marvel movies that much, but I know that one. This is the monster movie franchise rebooted by Tom Cruise. No, this this one I actually haven't seen any of these movies but I'm gonna guess it's the mummy and I was right the word prequel became more common in the late 90s upon the release of a prequel in which sci-fi saga Blade Runner Star Trek Transformers or Star Wars it really helps that they just have a picture they basically just give the answer away but it's Star Wars with the Phantom Menace and it was a prequel after Harry Potter discovered his true self in the Sorceress Stone which sequel came next I haven't seen the Harry Potter Potter movies I've only ever seen the first one so I don't really know this one I think it's the Chamber of Secrets and I got it right I actually bought the blu-ray box set but I haven't got around to seeing them all because they're just so long like literally all of them are over two and a half hours like any longer guys but maybe one day I'll get to watching it I have no idea these glasses hurt my eyes which Hulk film did the 2008 MCU version reboot I don't even get this one which Hulk film did the 2008 version reboot the Incredible Hulk oh yeah, see, I knew the 2003 one's just called Hulk, but I didn't understand the question. They're talking about, all right, which one did it reboot? It was from Hulk. I knew that one. I actually own it on DVD, but it's down there. I don't feel like getting it. Red Dragon was the prequel film of which terrifying thriller? Halloween Saw, Silence of the Lambs, or The Grudge. It was Silence of the Lambs. I actually wouldn't have known that. I only know it because of the picture. I wish they didn't have it. It just gives it away, but whatever. After Before Sunrise, which sequel got scheduled next? I have no idea what this movie even is. I'm to literally just guess uh this one right there hey i got it right i'm just that much of a movie nerd guys somehow i became more cringy too with these glasses which of these thor films was the second sequel dark world ragnarok civil war or endgame it's so funny because i actually don't like marvel movies that much but i know this one and it was the dark world oh Second sequel. I gotta actually slow down. I would have got that, but I didn't read it. Well, I did, but I didn't understand it. It's second sequel. Next one. Emma Watson starred in the live action remake of which Disney animated classic? Well, gee, I wonder. You got a giant picture literally telling me what it is. I actually wouldn't even have known that, but uh, let me guess. Uh, Aladdin? Uh, oh, Beauty and the Beast, because you have a giant photo. From the Fast and Furious franchise, which one served as the prequel? And it was Fast... I thought it was Fast and Furious, the fourth one. Because they made Tokyo Drift, and then they had to make prequels after that. I have no idea. Fast Five? I didn't know that one, because I thought Fast and Furious, this one, I thought this was a prequel. This is the fourth movie, and it comes after Tokyo Drift. But I think this is a prequel. I have no idea, or maybe it's not. I don't even remember these movies. Which of these Mad Max films feels more like a remake than a sequel? That'd be Fury Road. I actually recently just saw the Mad Max movies. One and two were really good. Number three was all right. It just felt very 80s. And then the fourth one was entertaining. This Indiana Jones adventure was the prequel of the series. Name which one? I love Indiana Jones, so I know this off the top of my head. And it was Temple of Doom. I love the Indiana Jones movies. Temple of Doom is my favorite. And then Raiders, Last Crusade, and uh, that's it. That's all there is. Three movies. Uh, I don't even know this one. Hey, I got it. <laughs> Got it right, guys. The Terminator Originals immediate sequel has which title? And that'd be Judgment Day. Which title of the Lord of the Rings middle film sequel? It's The Two Towers. X-Men First Class is which kind of film? A sequel, right? A prequel? Oh, no, I didn't even see that movie, so I wouldn't have no idea. Oh my, I, literally, I was gonna skip this one. I wasn't gonna put that in the video, and I got it right. I, I'm just telling you, it's crazy. Which one is the prequel of Monsters, Inc.? It's Monsters University. I actually saw that in the theater when I was like a kid. I don't know why, I just did. I also saw Paul Blart Mall Cop 2 in the theater, so I gotta love it. Among the Dollars trilogy, this was the prequel film. What's the title? The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly? I didn't even know that was a prequel. I thought it was a sequel, but all right, I'll take it. I've never seen the Pirates of the Caribbean movie, so I would have no idea. I'll take a guess. Oh, I got it wrong. Hey, I got that one right. Uh, see, like, I'm skipping the ones I don't know, because I, I literally just don't know them. Search for the right sequel. Finding Nemo or Finding Dory? Finding Dory. It's the first Transformer sequel without Megan Fox. Know the title? No, because I hate those movies. But I think it's The Last Night. Oh, Dark of the Moon. I would have no idea. In the Die Hard series, which was the last sequel in 2013? It's the one movie I haven't seen, so I know it. Live Free or Die Hard? 
Wow, I went too quick. I actually would have known that because I have the movies right up there. So I went too fast. I got to slow down. Uh, This one, I think, is Freaky Friday. There we go. This one was so easy. It was just The Hobbit. Like, I literally just looked at the photo and I knew it. Which of these Batman film sequels did Tim Burton direct? It was Returns. All right, so my score was a 60% because a lot of them I just rushed through or I didn't take my time or I got it wrong on purpose because I didn't know the question. I didn't even see that movie. I'm a fraud. I'm going to take these glasses off because I'm just that much of a fraud.